Yo, what's good? What's good? It's the one, the only, but what do I know? Boxing back at you with actually another one. So check this out, man. <laughs> oh my goodness, man. The back and forth. This is going to be a quick video. <clears throat> but the back and forth that these guys are, um, <clears throat> are having is kind of funny. Cambosis basically feels like Devin Haney is a traitor because he was going for he was going against his own countrymen. But check this out, rising, um, I don't, I'll see whatever boxer George Cambosis Jr. has invited George Jeff Horn to sort out their differences in the ring. <clears throat> if he has a problem with him serving as Manny Pacquiao's sparring partner, Horn said earlier this month he was disappointed in the 24 year old didn't get in contact with him before accepting the invitation to join the Filipino great training team ahead of Sunday's battle. So, basically, a wristband or whatever. <clears throat> but so basically, what if y'all for y'all that don't know, George Cambosis was like, it, it's a video that went viral of like Devin Haney basically getting super excited when George Cambosis won, won the belt. Now, to back to go into the backstory of that, when, when George Cambosis beat Teofimo Lopez, the reason why Devin Haney was excited because Teofimo Lopez was not interested in fighting Devin Haney. So, but George Cambosis, before he even fought Teofimo, George Cambosis gave Devin Haney his word that he would fight Devin Haney um, <clears throat> should he get past Teofimo Lopez. So, when the reason why Devin Haney was rooting for George Cambosis because he knew that he would get that fight. And if Teofimo Lopez won, he would not have been able to fight for all the belts with Teofimo Lopez. That's why he was cheering for, uh, that's why he was rooting for George Cambosis to win, so he could then have a chance to fight for all the belts. All right. Secondly, I find that mighty funny how you, he wants to criticize Devin Haney for going against his countryman, yet his countryman was about to fight, was in the midst of getting ready for a fight, for the fight with Pacquiao, and he was helping Pacquiao to beat his own countrymen. So, in a sense, not even in a sense, you're basically doing exactly what you're criticizing Devin Haney of doing. Like, that's what I be talking about when I say George Cambosis just be talking, bro. Like, he don't... I, man, that dude just be running his damn mouth, bro. Like, it don't make no sense. Like, you sitting here criticizing Devin Haney or you were going against your own countrymen, but yet you were helping Pacquiao uh, in his fight against Jeff Horn, your countrymen. So you were helping Pacquiao training to beat Jeff Horn, your countryman. So that's a big contradiction, Mr. Georgie. That's a big contradiction. That's all I'm saying, George. That's a big contradiction. So I, that's what I'm telling y'all, man. This dude just be running his mouth, man. I, I promise you, I hope Devin Haney, I hope Devin Haney punishes dude. Dude just like Cause he, the stuff that he says Like it don't even make sense bro Like you sitting here talking about Devin Haney was forced into a fight with you How the hell was Devin Haney forced into that fight You was forced to fight Devin Haney You wanted to fight Lomachenko So how the hell you Like bro it don't even make no sense you, you going against your own countryman But yet you helping Manny Pacquiao To go against Jeff Horn Your countryman So Don't try to talk about Devin Haney When you contradicting yourself That's what I'm talking about though y'all that's what I'm talking about. George Cambosis contradictions. <laughs> the Cam the Cambosis contradictions. Anyways, man, let me know what you guys think, man. Like, comment, subscribe. But what do I know?